You want to cook crystal meth? That's right. You know the business, and I know the chemistry. What do you ask the assistants to do for you, um, you know, to, to prep for you? And do they get the chance to cut any scenes for you? Yeah, um, basically the assistants, assistants get my dailies ready, get them all ordered and laid out the way that I'm used to working. Um, they'll do that. And then when I'm done cutting a scene, I'll pass it to them. They'll, do the, they'll start the basic soundscape. And then as I'm working, I'll keep embellishing on it and, and enhancing it. And that sounds great to get that help. Yeah, it's, it, it makes a big difference because then I'm, I don't have to concentrate on that. They'll put the sound beds in and a lot of the hard effects. And if there's anything I feel is missing, I'll go and start putting those little bits and pieces in. Right. I need to know what to ask for now. Um, I think <laughs> a lot of us need to know to what to uh, ask our wonderful assistants to help us out with um, because that really can train them into, a, that can give them a lot you know, and a, a lot of training. That's yeah. really good. And, and, um, and to me, it also yeah. makes sure that they're watching the scene and understand why I've done something. And if, if I ask them when you're doing it, watch the scene, tell me if anything jumps out and bothers you, if there's something that doesn't work, and then I'll sit down and revisit that and work with them. And as you asked the question, yes, I do have my assistants cut scenes. I want them, because there is no longer an apprentice program so the assistants are doing everything. So I feel as an editor, somebody needs to help pass on knowledge to them and get them into a position they can start cutting. So I love my assistants to cut scenes. And then once they cut it, I will sit there and watch it with them, give them my notes, my input, and we'll do that until the scene is where I feel it's ready to present to the director and or the producer.